Deepfakes could play a part in the 2020 presidential election, but are campaigns ready to fight this misinformation? The recent altered video of Speaker of the House Nancy Pelosi, which was slowed to make her slur her words, is the latest example of a fake video that 2020 contenders might have to deal with. According to a report by Axios, the campaigns may not currently be equipped for this fight. The media outlet reports that most of the Democratic ones said they would be relying on the Democratic National Committee for help in that area. However, the DNC told Axios that wasn't really their job, but did say they continually email campaigns tips for dealing with misinformation. Their counterpart, the Republican National Committee, said they don't usually work with campaigns on cybersecurity. As for President Trump, a campaign official says it, quote, maintains constant vigilance, claiming to Axios it does so, quote, since the media and others online routinely distort the president's remarks, record, and positions. Julian Castro's campaign told the media outlet that the Department of Homeland and security and the FBI should be involved. While in a statement to Axios, Representative Tulsi Gabbard said the media should have, quote, a major role in discrediting deep fakes. It appears the campaigns themselves aren't interested in combating this new trend, as an anonymous consultant who has met with several campaigns told Axios, quote, we don't feel like they are serious about investing the resources required to do anything about it. And that could be troubling in a social media dominating age where the doctored video of Nancy Pelosi took over a day to be debunked, and even then, it still hasn't been removed from Facebook, showing candidates they may not be able to rely on similar platforms for help with deep fakes.